DeSantis vows to stop Chinese commies from buying Florida land. I wish it was more governors and more uh, um, government officials like him that that are um, that are uh, 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 stopping the Chinese, the, the CCP, from um, from invading our, our country, basically. Uh, and, and even people on the right are acting like this is not a big deal, but uh, what the Chinese is doing is a big deal. We're going to talk a little bit about that today. Um, but before we get started, go ahead and hit that like button, share this out so we can get this information out there. Subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. Hit that alarm bell so you know when I'm putting out new stuff. Also, check out my link tree in the description. Um, has a link to my Patreon where I talk about things I can't talk about here. There's also a link to my Instagram and my merch store where I have I Will Not Comply t-shirts as well. So check that out too. All right, let's talk about this news. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis has expressed concerns over the Chinese Communist Party, CCP, gobbling up land in the United States and other um, countries in the Western Hemisphere, according to the Daily Wire. He claims that the Chinese are working with globalists to undermine the West by buying property as part of their strategy. DeSantis stated that it is not in the best interest of Florida to have the CCP owning farmland, owning land close to military bases. Um, he believes this uh, could pose a threat to the um, state's security and sovereignty. And it, I believe it poses a threat to not only that, to the entire country. I mean, they're already finding uh, a CCP or Chinese uh, uh, police stations set up all over the country. And where's the FBI on this? I think they did bust one. I give them that. But where are where's the FBI on all of this with the um, of Chinese infiltration? They have infiltrated so much of our government. That's why Beijing Biden is is caping for them and protecting the Chinese. I think they're a real, real credible threat. And like I said, um, like I alluded to earlier, even people on the on the right are dismissing this. But it is a big deal. Um, according to the the American Enterprise Institute. China currently owns over 1.2 million acres of land in the, in the United States, including nearly 700,000 acres of farmland and about 500,000 acres of commercial and in, industrial property in states such as California, Iowa, Nebraska, and Oklahoma. In 2020, foreign, foreign policy reported that a Chinese firm with close CCP ties was building a massive wild farm just 70 miles from Laughlin Air Force Base in Southwest uh, Texas. Um, how is it legal for a uh, uh, um, uh, how is it legal for a government uh, uh, to allow this to happen? To allow another country to come in and buy up all this land? Um, DeSantis also said that he doesn't want the CCP purchasing homes in uh, the state. "Quote: My view is." Okay, yeah, no farmland, but why would you want them buying residential developments or things like that? I don't want them owning subdivisions or things like that. He believes that allowing the CCP to own uh, homes in Florida could also lead to them gaining influence um, on that economy. And I 1,000% I agree with everything that uh, DeSantis is saying, what he's doing right now pertaining to the CCP. Again, hopefully more governors will step up and do what he's doing. Hopefully more uh, government officials, people in, in the federal government will start doing something about this. Why would you allow, they're our supposed enemy, right? They're helping Russia, right? And we're supposed to be so against Russia, but yet you allowing them to purchase all this land, to purchase uh, farmland at, at that, you know, and things that, that that would be beneficial to our country. Why would you allow uh, the CCP to, to do this? But um, let me know what you think. Leave your comments down below. Like, share, and subscribe. And check out democrepublics.com for the latest in news. Until next time, peace. Oh,